Dear Mr Kenny, I am a reasonable person. I don't mind if the government has to use my tax money to improve the water infrastructure. Let's improve it. What I do mind is you spending one billion to develop a billing system, not one euro of which will help improve the water system. From the cost of the actual meter to the cost of the man, the cost of the van and the cost of the equipment and time it will take to install it for one household and then repeating that 1.65 million times all over the country will cost nearly 1 billion. Then add to that the technology and the cost of building a billing system, the staffing of a call centre, administration staff and finance team, credit control and the printing and posting of bills every month, the visa charges, bank charges, website charges, TV and radio charges, brand design charges. Let's not even mention the consultancy charges, none of which would help improve the water infrastructure. It just allows you to send me a bill. I would have just spent that one billion on improving the water infrastructure. You created Ishka as a separate entity so that it could attract funding, funding so that they could improve the water infrastructure. Funding equals a loan, which, as you know, is more debt. This debt is likely to come from foreign private investment. So now you have created a hugely indebted company with a massive cost structure that has massive debt to repay. We both know that you will have to increase the bill charges to cover all of these costs. Either that or your plan is to give shares and therefore ownership in this new company in return for funding. Either way, it is very, very possible that a minister would suggest privatising Ishka or selling it because it would become such a drain on the exchequer. Board Gosh was sold to a British PLC for one billion. The same is possible with Ishka. Your pinky promise that it won't happen doesn't cut it. Water is too important. It is my water, it is my children's water, and it belongs to each and every Irish person. I need an absolute guarantee enshrined in our constitution that it can never be sold. Kind regards.